There has been another recent finding that has focused and redoubled the Grim Verity's efforts and interests as of late. Um, a member of ours who is uh, a researcher in Vasselheim discovered ancient texts from as far back as the founding. The Verity believes it references in the highest temples that there is a time before Ruidis. There are texts where Katha was the only moon above. The other thing is apparently some of these texts refer to two gods that don't exist in the Pantheon. What? And haven't since. Are they? Forgotten deities. So Rue disappeared when those deities disappeared. We don't have a specific timeline, but the texts seem to refer to a similar era in the founding, and we very much theorize they are connected somehow. What you are considering is possible. The lay right, it's an apogee solstice, moving a ley line off into other planes of existence Primordials are deeply attached to the same form of geomancy that creates ley lines. The names that are written in the Eldritch Battery are written to wake these things up. But you realize if they're written to wake them up, it can be, those names can be used to summon them. And if it can be used to summon them, it can be used to banish them. You remember, um, these primordials have hundreds of names and you are writing all of them. And it's as simple as changing this from moving a ley line into the astral realm to moving these primordials into the astral realm. Avalir descending. As it comes down towards its ancient home, Toramunda, Mount Igora, where Raushan and Kamort were sealed by the Dawn Father and the Wild Mother in the schism in ages long past. As the city docks atop Kath Moira, the sun threatening to rise above the horizon, the energy rushes into the ground, their names inscribed to break the ancient wards, to release primordials, a colossus of fire, a titan of earth, to join the betrayers and bring eternal torment to Exandria. That is what was foretold. If the primordials joined, all would be lost. The energy rushes into the earth, connected to the lay right, and swirls preparing to summon them back into Exandria, and instead the lay right crafts a path away from this world. You made your choice. Safety for Avalir and Kathmoira and the lands of Dominus, or certainty that Exandria in some form would survive the coming calamity. <laughs>